Today's video is about uploading an image to your user account. And I selected the upload file and now I'm going to answer several questions that are on forms. First is to select my file from the browser and allow that to upload. Good. Now I'm going to select if this is my own work. It is indeed my own work and I'm asked to sign a licensing agreement and I'm just going to accept the one they have. I've just read it and next and now I need to place a description for the image. In our case I think a name like a caption name and a uh, description of what is being shown. So I'll think about this for a second. Doesn't need to be elaborate, just one sentence is fine. Okay, and then I want to add a date the work uh, was created or uploaded today. And I want to add a keyword category that helps people search on it. I want to use architecture and drawing. Oops. So what happens is you need to uh, use the add another category button in order to add two separate, uh, in our case, uh, names, architecture and drawing. And then after this we're going to go check. We could put a, a, a location information. You could do that with the location of your site. That would be cool. But for now we're just going to go see what we did. Um, first we're going to copy this URL into our favorite text editor because we're going to need that for the next video when we make this image visible from our account. So I'm going to open up my text wrangler, copy paste, the uh, URL for that project and I also need some code which I'm going to use later on in the Wikimedia page. So I'm going to copy this and I'll paste it also into my text wrangler file just as a uh, scratch pad. And what's going to happen is um, when we go back and look at the view, we're not going to see the, the drawing that we just uploaded. Um, that has to be programmed and we'll do that in the next video. Thanks.